could buy a plane. Oh, that's uh, a lie. Uh, you know, you Yoko, fed you Roman's cousin. It's Vlad. Vlad? The uh, name doesn't ring any bells. I'm sorry. You better start remembering important people, you dumb peasant. Your cousin owes me a lot of money. If you don't want to make things real difficult for him, you are going to come to Kamrat Bar in Mohawk. I have a work for you. Ah, uh, fuck you! You're a bunch of pussies and fags! Nice. I'm going back to the meeting! Good. I'm going to be somebody! Yeah, yeah. See you later, Mel. You always were an asshole, Mickey! Hey, watch where you're going! Hey! <laughs> hey! That's what I tried to tell you. Fuck Dude, you! Excuse me. So, anyway, I see you later, okay? Yoko, Fetty Roman's cousin. What's your name again? Big Mouth Prick. Very catchy. Sit down. Cousin... Uh, Nico. That's it, Nico. Not Big Mouth Prick. You funny guy. I try. Yes, and this one's. I'll let you take the shit out of me. Take the shit? Yes, me give out. I don't understand. Ah, people who fuck with me, get fucked with! Okay, fine. Calm down. Whatever. Some old man not paid me in months. And I'm not the kind of person who is treated this way. Old bastard owns a china shop in the Campton Avenue in Dukes. Here you go. Don't hurt him. Just teach him a lesson. I don't need a bat to teach a lesson. sitcom Family Interrupted, which is set in a women's clinic. You love him, I love him, the women love him. He's slept with most of you, I imagine. It's Brandon Roberts. Brandon, you look great. Hey, thanks. I, I know. I really do. You know, it's good. Whatever show this is, it's great. Now, if you weren't a man of remarkable integrity, I'd say you had some work done there, Brandon. Nice t-shirt. Yeah, yeah, this t-shirt is part of our campaign. See, we're gonna kill global warming once and for all. Okay, but sometimes these scientists, they, they just make things confusing. It takes actors... Hey, let me in. You have led protection money, old man. Big Vlad and his protection money? I'm so scared. What I need protection from? You think this door is going to save your shop? There's shit I can break up here. Vlad should pay me to tell punks like you to go away. He get no money. Shit, brain! I pay up now! I pay up! Shit! Here! I thought Vlad and I had understanding. Only thing I understood was you owed him money.
not indeed, baby. There was something short. To hey, Yokel, you managed to do the job? Get Vlad his money? He paid up. I had to smash the shop up pretty good, but he paid. Don't worry your little peasant head about it. Stupid jerk made a mistake of telling me how much he gets that shit for back east. He's the biggest crook in the neighborhood. Lucky I don't tell his customers what they're paying for. That it? Can I go now? Sure. Get out of my face. <laughs>